We're at Cracker Barrel. Yeah, we wanted to be by the fire, but we're way back here freezing. Hey there, I just got home from school and I actually thought it was going to be cancelled like halfway through because all of a sudden the, this blizzard started, it was like raining earlier and all of a sudden there's just snow everywhere. So, right now I am going to edit yesterday's video. I didn't do it last night because I was up all night doing schoolwork. I literally did schoolwork from 6 to 1.30, which is also why I didn't have any clips outside of the mall yesterday, you know, due to that. Um, I also had no sleep last night, so I'm exhausted and I'm tired. So when I'm done editing yesterday's vlog, I'll probably be sleeping until wrestling is on later. So see you later. Bye. Restaurant we go to today because I'm out of sweet and low at home. Not that I use it because I don't. This one here, we use it. But everywhere we go today, we're gonna steal sweet and low. <laughs> Got it? Got it. Sock monkeys are not supposed to do this. Alrighty guys, we made our first purchases of the day at Cracker Barrel. I got this awesome throw blanket for the chair in my bedroom, the circle chair, that I wanted for a long time and it was on clearance for 70% off and it was $40 originally and it came out to $12.99. And then we got some candy. I of course got my favorite, gummy bears. My dad got orange slices. I These look pretty disgusting, but whatever to each his own. My mom got some really hot cinnamon jawbreakers. And then she also got a sugar daddy. So that was our first thing of the day. And apparently there's an accident coming up, so hold on if we get some kind of, some kind of activity where there are flashing lights. So I'll show you if we uh, get close enough. Oh. Oh. Wow. Well. Going to the mall. Look at these clocks. These clocks are insanely cool. Look at that one. Like a flower. So cool. Smelling, it's really pretty. I'm gonna look over the village. I'm having a serious problem here. I'm having a block. I cannot spend money. Anybody who knows me knows that this is not a problem usually. And I've been in how many stores now? Like six or seven. Six or seven stores. And bought two dog biscuits. That's it. We're at a little coffee store, getting some hot chocolate. Ate a mess. We found an arcade. There's a carousel. We're playing some t ball. Awesome. What does this do? Jumping jackpot. Well, now 
easy to beat. All right, Daddy's up. I'll probably show you how to do. What'd you get? Yeah. Seventeen thousand. All right, I'm up. Mom was on a roll. Mom's got big time score going on over there. Mom's up to 19. She just hit a 5,000. Nice. We gotta get our tickets. Our tickets. Oh. Oh. Mom with a 32,000. 33,000. Get all the tickets. Woo! Hello. My mother and I are going to have a air hockey battle. Here goes the battle. The battle is on. Mom against daughter. My money's on daughter. This, uh, this is a boring game. Score. Mom's up one nothing. I see more excitement at a snail race. Get your finger, I was gonna say, get your fingers off of there, you're gonna know it. Mom's just shooting away and not scoring. Story of her life. Now, I'm sorry that you have to watch this boredom. Oh, the boredom. This should be called Who Sucks More? <laughs> Damn, now she's throwing it. Oh, jeez. We have puckage off the row. It is now Mother 3, Raquel. Nothing. It's not looking It's not looking good for Raquel. The game is almost over. Next goal is probably going to call it. So let's see if mom can... No, it's no shutout. That's still up. Still got one more. I got one. It is 3-1. We still got more gold. See if Raquel can get make it 3-2. Oh! Mother almost got it. Mother-daughter challenge. Here it is. It's coming down to the last goal. Score! Score! Somebody score! I'm bored. Oh. It's still on, it ain't over yet. Rocks up 4-3, look out. Rock hit two. Mom's getting nervous because she's getting beaten now. Now she's complaining. It's still on. Nah. Oh, now it's over. All right, we ready? All right, here's a wheel spin for tokens. Go ahead, spin it away. Here we go. Round and round it goes. Where it stops, nobody knows. 25 tickets. 25 tickets last time. Let's see. I don't know. We've got one of them stupid game things up there, I'm sure. I think we're looking at a three this time. Oh. Three. Yay. Yoo-hoo. Boo. Three tickets. My father is a basketball champion, so let's see how he fares. We're gonna see who scores better, me or daddy.
Player number one, that was me. No, that was me. I was playing. He got 27, I got 47. I got it from my daddy. I beat him in basketball, I beat him in basketball. Dad's gonna spin the big bass wheel. All right, we're going. Would you get 50? Aw. Okay, I got a disc shooter and a smiley face tattoo. So now we're basically just walking around the little village place square. There's lots of, uh, sorry the snow is getting all over. There's lots of country shops and stores and things. A little high up view of the square. I don't know if I can walk up here. This is awfully scary. It's like this little platform. So my mom just made reservations for a colonial dinner featuring where they're all in costume and everything featuring uh, Molly Pitcher and Dolly Madison. So that should be really exciting and like here's the map of where we are in this little square village. Thrilling. thrilling. Should be thrilling. Should be. I'm actually excited. I think it's going to be interesting. Okay, we just made our reservation for five at this colonial dinner where they're going to dress up. And tonight we have, like I said, Molly Pitcher and Dolly Madison. And we have, I got the menu. I just thought I'd show you while I have it here. So we just stopped at this little country supermarket. The Nun Such Market. And I got some Clover Farms chocolate milk and my mom got some raw bee honey. Honey. So we just got back to the square and a car just pulled up at the restaurant and um, I see someone in a bonnet which means I think we found our actors. Because <laughs> bonnets are not in unless you're a colonial actor. So what I think will be my last purchase of the day, my dad bought me a bracelet from his favorite religious poem. I can't get it to, let me see if I can get it to focus. Well, it says, when you have seen only one set of footprints, that is when I carried you. We got the footprints. And it's like really blurry, but it's really pretty. All right, we are here. I don't know how much time to spare, if any. Not many. <laughs> it is two minutes to five. All right, with two minutes to spare for our dinner reservation. Uh, also, uh, I'm reading about um, more about Dutch because that's what our, um, our site was uh, settled by a Dutch from uh, New Amsterdam, Staten Island, and they like to evidently yes. they like having, according to the historians, they like having cheese and bread with it. Okay. Yeah. Might have some, something else, and also some people yeah. didn't have sure. but two meals a day. Oh, but, um, you know, Yeah, it's, I think that's that one. Yeah, I'm not sure I get to the right one. Brown the um, rim of yeah. the pie, yeah. yeah. And this was, um, Carol did a nice job on this. It's sour cream, so that would be yeah. easy yeah. enough yeah. to have yeah. it. Yeah. Well, okay. Uh, Engine's diner area. Yeah. Yeah. Maybe a demonstration. So we just got here, it's got money over there, stop looking at me like that. Yeah, good. Thank you. So it's like a four course kind of deal, and we just got the first course, which is beef vegetable soup. Oh my I remember the guy we saw getting out of the van? I found him, and he found a guitar. <laughs> cool. 
course number two. Some kind of, I don't even know, jello y thingy. <laughs> Welcome to colonial times. Things just got very colonial. This is the coolest thing I've ever done in my life. Okay, so we just got the main course. I got beef brisket. It's really yummy. I'm excited. It's still I am. Hey, look, guys, it's Dolly Madison. So we just met Dolly Madison. Picture and I got some hot cider, very colonial. <laughs> Car to head home after our colonial dinner. So I'm gonna get a last shot of the village. Okay, so that colonial dinner was really, really, really cool. What do we think? Cool. It was, it was really good. Definitely enjoyable. Totally worth it if you're ever here during the season at Peddler's Village. It's really interesting. Hello there. It's 11:30. I just finished watching wrestling. I basically edited and uploaded yesterday's vlog and took my nap like I said I was going to, so it wasn't really in anything interesting for me today, but I know Raquel has lots of footage for you. She's been stressing over, you know, cutting it down and editing it for everybody, but I'm sure you probably enjoyed it. Um, I'm going to go to sleep now. Hope you enjoyed this vlog. I know I did. So I'll see you tomorrow. Farewell.